You're really good. Really, 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 good. really, really good. Please welcome Jonathan Ansel. It's Jonathan Ansel. Please welcome Jonathan Ansel. A special guest this morning. He's bound to hit the right note. The fabulous Mr. Jonathan Ansel. Look. <laughs> Name your son Dexter after the serial killer. I was about to ask the same question. <laughs> Look, he's, he's a nice serial killer. I think the breastfeeding is so, so important. If you mm. can do it and if you're able to do it, it's wonderful. But I think you've got to use sense. I used to be a lifeguard when Did I was you? younger. And I, if I saw someone breastfeeding a wave pool, I would absolutely advise them that wouldn't be a safe thing to do. How interesting. Did you save lives out of interest? I didn't save any lives. I just uh, I got a few phone numbers. That did was you, the best did thing you about stop it. <laughs> Number one album. Excited about that? Really, really excited. It's amazing. Just knock out something. Just a quick tune. Go. It's now or never. See? Come hold me tight. <laughs> <laughs> if you, if you We're yes. going to make some uh, spicy fish cakes. And uh, the great thing for me is that I was able to catch this fish in your beautiful bay <laughs> in Auckland. You, you look Rack to me like blender. you know what you're doing. Well, I are try. You, but are you a bit of a, you know? I love to cook and I've always enjoyed it. So we dress it up like this. Yeah. And then just plate it in. And then it's just a nice simple salad. But can you sing us out? Que bella cosa, now you're not a soul. I have no idea what he said, but gosh, it was good. First to host is X Factor star and Housewives favourite, Jonathan Ansel. I'm incredibly competitive in every single thing that I do. Jonathan then turns his attention to the starter and uses a unique way to warm his goat's cheese. With predictable results. <laughs> Dinner's nearly ready. <laughs> Tastes nice. It's delicious. Beautiful. And first at the door is Jonathan, no doubt in one of his dapper dinner jackets. Oi, Sam B. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It was the weirdest finish to a meal. Winner is. Equal first, Jonathan Harvey! <laughs> Final up. Oh, it's the right answer! Yeah. You just won 50,000. Ah. <laughs> Who's won today's challenge? You can see it's a red chicken win! Right. So, I prepared this for you. <laughs> Could you sing that? Because I'd like to record it and play it to people. Would sing you give it. it a go? Never, ever, ever, ever spend on a credit card. You've balanced transferred on. Oh, the question I got is that league tables are more important Absolutely. than the well-being of your child. That's because parents look at them so stringently and then it makes an impact on housing prices and all sorts of things it because does. everyone wants to have a good school in the close proximity in the catchment that they can actually obtain for their children, especially in, in London, in built-up areas. It's going to be so much harder to get into better schools. But what is a better school? Because um, league tables and Ofsted is a certain characteristic of the school, but actually so. other schools are excelling in other areas. What? It's one of the many things about How Ofsted assessments. So so it's all about what is the quality of the school, the teachers, yeah. and, uh, and, and not about an Ofsted report. You need to feel happy in your education. Yeah.